This is my background music Cause I don't wanna get copyrighted So I made my own shit to this beat Kinda laying low key But join the team Subscribe, subscribe What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel I'm Deja Hello! So today's video is a video I really didn't know if I wanted to do it or not But A lot of you guys have been um, sending me the link to this video, telling me I should react to it, do reacting, da, da, da. and honestly, this is like my first reaction video. I think I filmed since I've like did YouTube ever. The reason why I wasn't gonna do it is because I've seen videos of like parents or like the parent exposing their daughters or whatever on live and stuff like that, and I don't really agree with it. I feel like it's very like degrading and like. Mm, mm, parenting skills questionable you know but um we're gonna see what this is about so i'm gonna pull it up here on my laptop and i have my cup of noodles okay i'm gonna eat those <laughs> hot okay so by the title i guess this is a oh it is a snapchat video <laughs> the mom's on the girl's snapchat and it says a daughter 16 so We'll see what she got to say. Hey everybody that's on Emma's new snap and covering for her, guess what? <laughs> mm -hmm. At 2.30 this morning, I found Bailey in her fucking closet. So unless each of you motherfuckers want me to come after y'all and go to your parents and tell them the shit that y'all are doing, you better back the fuck up. Do you understand? Okay? My kid's not going down. She's not going to be found dead in a ditch. She's not going to be on fucking drugs like half of y'all are. I'm... What does she do on her Snapchat that makes her mom assume that she's going to be dead in a ditch? Maybe drugs and stuff, huh? Get over it. So if I have to go to school and call you out name by name, if I have to go wherever and call you out, I will. Okay? Because oh, y'all taking will. her down long enough. Y'all taking her down? it's only your fault. Oh, no. Emma's responsible for her own decisions. Mm -hmm. But all you thought... I was just about to say that. Your daughter is responsible for her own decisions. What she ingest into her own body um it's her like you can't blame her friends i mean her friends do have you know peer pressure and stuff like that but i feel like if your daughter went behind your back and made another snapchat because that's what it seems she said she found out that her daughter had a, a new snapchat and then the friends didn't tell the mom first of all why would your friends tell your mom that oh your daughter has a new snapchat like what no mm-mm that let her add you on a new snapchat and didn't come to me and tell me yeah i got your numbers and you're next on my list of parents to call i'm f***ing over it i'm over your little badasses trying to be f***ing adults when you're only 16 years old and bailey just wait wait a minute is her daughter bailey or emma what is her daughter <laughs> emma her daughter is emma so bailey must be the little girl best friend She's doing a lot of cussing, I don't have to bleep out, okay? This way. The 20 year old who's my kid. She's 16! That's Savannah Daniel. Savannah, it's my understanding that you got Emma to buy some weed. If you got her to buy weed and smoked it with her, then you are fixing to be in big trouble. <laughs> you are fixing to be in big trouble. Over it. And you also got drunk enough that you lost your phone in the toilet at Skylar's birthday party. That's the truth. Guess what your mom's finding out today? Oh, she's snitching, snitching, okay? She's saying names, stop. How does she know? Oh, maybe she watched the little girl's Snapchat. You see, I'm grown, and I get so many people adding me on Snapchat a day. Like, I can't see if I'm getting, like, family added, like, who actually follows me um, on Snapchat. Because I get, like, so many views on Snapchat and so many, like, people out of me a day i can't really tell who actually is on my snapchat watching my stories and like on snapchat i'm kind of like no filter <laughs> so i apologize if you on my snapchat you're my family but i'm grown so like it doesn't matter it's just an opinion from there <laughs> call her right now hey lindsay oh hi it's me again you're not allowed to be around my kid because you're fucking bad and i've already had a run in with you <laughs> guess what fixing to go to heather with your bullshit too No, your daughter is 16.
I've already called the school, turn in your names, and I'm calling your parents tonight. Whoa! And I'll be doing this with the help of Emma's dad. I know y'all don't think so, but we do come together at times like this, and this is one of those times because... Wait a minute, that means... <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but that means... Emma's mom and Emma's dad don't really get along that well because she just said, like, y'all wouldn't expect us to come together, but we are. So that means they're either not together in the home or they don't have that good of a relationship, but we're just going to keep watching. The simple fact that she's snitching on people, she called people schools, tell it, like, damn. It's, uh, it's your daughter. Like, your daughter is bad. <laughs> I'm going to save our kids' life while all you other dumb motherfuckers keep on making bad decisions and end up dead and fucking. I was at the Mardi Gras parade last last year with mm -hmm. Amy this this past March, mm -hmm. and I'd like to tell y'all that there was a young girl there who her friends dumped her off, and she was puking and swallowing it and aspirating it back down, and her friends left her laying on the sand. What the Did f is wrong her? with you, dumb motherfuckers? I mean, you all are the dumbest bitches I've ever met in my whole f***ing life. I f don't understand this shit. You all think your pussies are lined with gold, and you can just go out and do whatever the f*** you want to do? Oh, whoa, 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 <laughs> they went from Mardi Gras to STD, let me rewind it. You're fucking crazy. Now, Emma's gone to get tested for an STD that Bailey probably gave her because he's also been f***ing two other girls. Yeah, I'm going all ham on this bullshit because I'm over it. So, if she comes back with an STD, the entire city of Navarre should look out. Okay? Pause. Does that mean your daughter be mm -hmm. everybody? And if it turns out she is, has STD, then the whole city of wherever she just said should be concerned. So what does that say about your kid, miss? Everybody that's covered for her and him Anybody that's had any knowledge that isn't texting my phone right now and telling me about it? Why would they tell? You all better look out. I am done. I'm done with your bullshit. Your parents can do whatever and let you all keep on being f***ing bad, but that's not where my kid's going to be. In fact, she's going to an all-girls home in Milton. So f*** each of you. Oh. She's going to an all-girls school. Do you think that that's going to help her not be bad? Her going to an all-girls school, I feel like, isn't going to do anything um, at all. She might start liking girls. You never know. <laughs> what I got from that, the 16-year-old, the girl, Emma. Emma, let me talk to you, Emma. Um, you obviously not sneaking by if your mama find all this out. You slipped up somewhere, but you having a 20-year-old boyfriend... I don't condone. You're 16. That's about 25 years for him. So, like, I guess he don't care. But her, she's the mom is mad at the fact that her friends haven't told her that her daughter has a Snapchat. Why would they tell you? Like, what? You're mad because your daughter's friends adding her on Snapchat. That's what Snapchat's for. You're supposed to add people. On that. I'm confused. But her daughter seems really bad. Um, I guess she little Tatiana because she just told her that the whole city better watch out. Personally, I wouldn't get on Snapchat, Instagram, live. If I just found out some stuff about my kid, okay. Um, why would the whole world need to see me discipline them the fact that people are honestly getting on live trying to like embarrass their kids is kind of like psh, to me but um i feel really bad <laughs> like i've seen some videos that are like really bad like you be doing too much like a mom exposed her daughter's like body on live and i was just like wow okay it was just too much i don't mm, that parenting cps where are you but that's that. That will conclude today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. If you made it this far, you're not yet subscribed. Woo! Hit that subscribe button. Open the description box and follow me on my other social medias. Okay, add me on Snapchat because your girl be shabobbing. Um.
But yeah, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my noodles. If you like these type of videos and want me to do more, maybe I'll do some. Reacting is kind of not my thing. I don't really like reacting videos, honestly. But um, I might just do it here and there if it's like a video that's entertaining like this one. That was kind of like, what? She's a so snitch. She about to tell on all they parents. I feel bad for all the little kids she named because y'all about to get in trouble. Like, in trouble. But on that note, I love you guys! Bye!